After an uneventful trip to a place called Hidden Valley, our afternoon drive ended at one of the slopes of Big Marsh where we came across two male lions. They have full bellies. Full belly? Yeah. One of these lions, Klaus and Hamisi had seen before. The older one, with the darker mane, named Masikio, meaning ear, a nod to his wrinkled right ear, had two days before been mating with one of the young females of the Big Marsh Pride. Now he had obviously reunited with his buddy. And his partner was who I had been hoping to find ever since he was first mentioned by other guests staying at the lodge. A lion that allegedly was walking around with a huge wound on top of his skull. One tourist had shown me pictures of brain matter clearly sticking out of torn up fur, skin and bone. Unfortunately, that afternoon, the cat never really presented his head from the front. Two days later, Luck was with Hamisi and Klaus again. Kidonda, wound, as he was aptly called by the local Maasai, crossed their paths for a second time, this time without Masikio. With no other vehicles around, the lion was very relaxed and calm, allowing us to drive up really close and get some fantastic shots. For us, it was amazing to see that Kadanda, despite his serious brain injury, was acting like any other lion with no apparent neurological deficits. 